Hey guys, so I have a uh, new products from Smashbox. So grateful to them. They sent me this in PR and I thought we could try this together. I will have an update as far as longevity and also price points. Anything that I can find about the product information will be down below. And this is what the PR box looks like. And it basically says sculpt with color. It's the new Halo Sculpt and Glow face palettes. These are buildable, blendable, smooths and blurs the skin, nourishes, lasts all day, and this is available at Ulta Beauty. So it says to shape the face with the contour. It has a sculpting blush. Then it has a pop of blush for like your apple of your cheeks and then the highlighter to add some glow. And they sent me two of them. I am not sure how many different shades there are. Let me check real quick. Okay, there are four different palettes available. They sent me two of them. They sent me the pink saturation, which seems to be the lightest one, and the Back to Cali. So they do have two other ones available. One is called Coral Situation with these beautiful coral shades in it. And then we have one called Berry Situation that seems for darker complexions or if you like more of a darker cheek color it has more darker like berry tone shades in there uh, i do feel like the pink sa saturation might be a little too light for darker skin tones but the other three seem to be a good mix to be able to use with uh, any kind of skin tone Anyways, let's get into it. Let me show you guys what the palettes look like. They look like this. They say Smashbox Halo on there. They actually tell you the name of each one of the products on the back and what to actually use them for. And we will be doing a little try on of these. But let me go ahead and show you when you open it up, it does have like a little sheet in there to show you how to actually use it. This is disposable so you can take it out. And this is the pink saturation so let me go ahead and let it um what's it called focus and i will have swatches to the side so you guys can see the swatches and maybe a picture of an up close so you guys can also see the comparison of both of these together likewise this one also has the same little sheet so that it comes in every one it also does have a mirror and this is called back to cali this one really calls my name. This is kind of like those uh, earth tone kind of peachy colors, which really gra I gravitate to a lot. I think of out of all the palettes, I think the one that really calls to me is the Cali one and then the Coral one that I saw online. And just for price point, so you guys know, this is $45. And I have to say, Smashbox, I've said this so many times in, in a lot of my videos, even before they sent me PR, Smashbox is really good about complexion products. They are actually a photo studio. They do a lot of, um, you know, makeup with photography. And I feel like they are one of my staples for um, like face products like foundation, concealer, powder. They just really primers. They're really good at those kind of products okay out of both of them i think i'm going to go ahead and test out the back to cali the first thing that i'm going to do is go ahead and sculpt my face using the bronzer here it's a mid-tone bronzer color so i feel like even someone who has a lighter skin tone would be able to use it uh, let me see what the one in here looks like so comparing the two, the one in the pink saturation is just slightly lighter, but you'll see the swatches to the side at some point. But let's go ahead and sculpt the cheeks. I'll do one side so you guys can see like a before and after basically. But oh yeah, that's beautiful. <laughs> so I'm just going to sculpt the cheek with this a little bit on my forehead and underneath the chin and just blend 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 like what they call the number three to just really sculpt the face next i'm going to use a different brush for the blush i'm going to use this one this says that this darker shade here is for like contouring the cheekbone 
and yeah so we'll see what this looks like but I'm just gonna put it just above that contour and they, it is a very beautiful color. It blends out nicely. I really, really love Smashbox products. So that's what that looks like. I'm just gonna wipe this off on a towel and then I'm gonna go in with that lighter shade that says that it's for a pop to the cheek. And I'm just gonna apply that to the, kind of like the apple of my cheeks. I'm just going based on their diagram. You could basically do this, do whatever you wanted to with these products as with any product, but I'm just kind of going with their diagram to see what it looks like. Next, I'm going to go in with the highlighter and this is a beautiful like light, very light gold shimmer and I'm just patting that onto that high point of my cheek. And that is what it looks like. Let me know what you guys think. I could bring it down a little bit because I, I kind of went a little bit overboard <laughs> with the cheek color. So let me just take a little bit of powder and blend that out a little bit. And here is nothing and here is with the palette. Let me know your thoughts. Do you feel like this really sculpts the face? I feel like it does. It kind of gives like that to it which I really really enjoy the shade does blend in really beautifully into the skin I had no issues whatsoever and yeah these are absolutely beautiful I know I'm gonna get a lot of use out of them the packaging is cute it has like little sparkles on the side very very just simple but beautiful and then i like that you know you have all four in one this is perfect for also if you're going to be traveling that way you just take this one palette and you have it have them have them have them all together here in one palette so you have your bronzer your blush and your highlight all in one let me know your thoughts down below i hope this was helpful if you guys are thinking of picking these up i'd love to hear from you and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys